Schulte, and I founded the Lipstick Project. I had been out of college for about five or six months and I was very restless because I wanted very much to be creating art and I didn't really know how or what I wanted to be doing um, with my degree in musical theater and um, I just knew that I wanted to be making something and I knew also that I wanted to feel like I was doing something good. I have known when there was no music with him but the drum and the fife and now Specifically to our local community, we have a lot of uh, female actors, a lot. Uh, I would probably, I think it's safe to say that the majority of the uh, actors in our community are female or identify as female. And the uh, majority of the parts uh, that are available to us are male. At heart, we are a theater company, and the production values are high, the talent level is high, the creativity level is high, and it's not just for entertainment, it's uh, to benefit others, and I think that we put on pretty darn good stuff. Doing all-female Shakespeare shows gives us opportunities um, that we would not otherwise have, and I've played some pretty amazing male roles since joining. When Shakespeare, Shakespeare first started, I mean, it was all men performing all these parts. Now you have all women, and it's such a different take. Uh, not only did you have to experience this, you know, wonderful and unique production, but um, every time you come to a show, you're supporting an amazing organization, not just us, but whichever organization the show is supporting. So, uh, I think that uh, women's voice has not been prevalent in the arts in general and um, in the last couple of years, in the last couple of decades um, with the advent of feminism, of third wave feminism, uh, we finally do are, are getting a voice and people are um, realizing that women are not a special interest group since we make up uh, more than half the population and more of more than half the workforce in um, the United States. It would be great if uh, people could go to uh, a show, or go see a movie, or read a book, and it just happens to be uh, about women by women. Um, that's not where we are. Uh, we're getting there. So that's why companies like the Lipstick Project are necessary uh, to sort of introduce, to, 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 let, to let people know that it's okay to see things about women and by women and for women, to know that they can still, even if the person is not the same gender as you, you can still identify from them, with them. You can still learn from them. The art. It's important that young girls growing up know that it is possible to do anything and that their voice is important, um, especially in a field where it can sometimes be easy to forget and can be put into a box. Um, I want to break the box. <laughs>